Let's go to Matthew chapter 6 verses 1 through 4. To the left is the King James Version, to the right is the Expanded Bible. Take heed that you do not your alms before men, to be seen of them. So what does alms mean? Let's look it up. Let's do it. Money or food given to poor people. So when someone speaks about alms giving, that is giving to people in need. Okay. So take heed that you do not your alms before men to be seen of them. So what does that mean? When you give to people, don't do it to receive recognition. For instance, don't make a YouTube video and show all of your good deeds to people to get views and accolades or hand claps and stuff like that. When you do for people, when you do good things for people, don't do it because you want to be rewarded for it in some type of way. Don't do good to people because you want your name to be known among everyone that you are a great person. No, when you do things for people, do it because God wants you to do it, not because the attention that you are going to receive from it. I pray that makes sense. Okay, let's continue. Otherwise, ye have no reward of your Father which is in heaven. So if you are trying to get recognition from people, attention from people, by doing good deeds, good deeds for people, if you are looking for attention, when you do good deeds for people, but you are doing it for attention, you lose your reward from God. We have to know that we are going to reap what we sow. When you do things out, yes, when you do things for the wrong reasons, you lose your reward. So when you do good, your heart has to be right. Meaning, when you are doing good, you are doing it with the right intentions. Not to glorify yourself, but to glorify God. Hey, I am helping people because I want people to come to God and place more attention on God. You are not supposed to do things to draw more attention to yourself. You are taking the glory from God when you are placing the attention on yourself. That is wrong. That is evil. What is the point of doing so much for people but your motives are wrong or evil. I am doing this for people because in the end, I am going to gain more from it. That is wrong. I want recognition, so let me do things for people so people can look at me as being great. That is wrong. And from what this is saying, you will lose your reward when you do that. Verse 2. Therefore, when thou doest thy alms, when you give to people in need, do not sound a trumpet, a trumpet before thee. So what does that mean? Don't sound the trumpet. <laughs> Let me highlight it. When somebody blows a trumpet or something really loud, what happens? They are trying to get the attention from other people. What if in a huge crowd, all of a sudden, somebody begins to scream like, ah! What happens? People's attentions, attention is going to turn toward that person that is screaming or making a loud noise. 
Okay, therefore, when thou doest thy alms, when you give to people in need, do not sound a trumpet before thee. So when you do good for people, stop trying to gain attention from it. Hey, I do this for that person. I do that for that person over there. Look at me. I am so good. I am so great. Raise me up. Praise me because I am giving to people and I am so good. That is wrong. That is wrong. That is so wrong. Stop trying to get attention and place the attention on God. When people say that my videos are good or blah, 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 I place the attention on God because in truth, I would not be able to do what I am doing now if it was not for God. I don't want the attention on me. I am doing this Yes, to help people, but mainly because God wants us to help other people. So I don't want accolades or a lot of attention and stuff like that. No. I take the attention off myself and place it on God because I don't care for attention, whatever. <laughs> I don't really care. I don't want to be praised in lift it up for what what do i gain from that all vanity waste of time unless your self-esteem is really messed up or something as the hypocrites so therefore when thou doest thy alms do not sound a trumpet before thee as the hypocrites do in the synagogues so what is a synagogue The building where Jewish assembly or congregation meets for religious worship and instruction. So let's say church. A Jewish church. Okay. Therefore, when thou doest thy alms, when you give to people who are in need, do not sound a trumpet trying to get attention, placing the focus on yourself, which is wrong. Sound a trumpet before thee as the hypocrites do in the synagogues and in the streets that they may have glory of men doing good things with the wrong motives. That is wrong. That is evil. You are not supposed to do that. When you do good, it is supposed to be out the kindness of your heart, not from like, hey, I am doing this for this person because I want to control them or I am using this to control that other person. Whatever reason you have to do that, that is wrong. That is wrong. That is wrong. My Lord. Where am I? Okay. I'm right here. Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. So if you are doing things for attention, that is your reward. So you lose your, I believe your earthly and your heavenly reward if you get to go to heaven. Verse three. But when thou doest alms, giving to the needy, let not thy left hand know what thy right hand doest. So do things in secret. The things that I do for people, I don't tell everyone. Now, sometimes when I teach, I may mention like, hey, I am doing this so you can do the same thing too. Like, hey, some people may need advice on what they can do for God. So I may mention every so often what I do for people so they can have an idea of what they can do for people as well. But I don't tell people to give me, I don't tell people what I do for others to get a pat on the back because I don't care about that. I really don't. <laughs> All right. So do things in secret. Do things because you want to glorify God. You want to, 
you want to please him because you love him. I am doing this for God, but secretly I am seeking for attention. That is wrong. Stop that. Four, that thy alms may be in secret, as I was stating. And thy father which seeth in secret, so God the Father, which seeth in secret, himself shall reward thee openly. So when you do things with the right motives, God is going to reward you, not only on earth, but in heaven if you go. So what have you learned here? If you have a short memory span, let's say that you can only remember 10 seconds of what I have said. When you do things for people, stop seeking attention from it. When you do things for people, do it in secret and God is going to reward you for it. Reward you for it. Why? Because you are going to reap what you sow. Always, in all things, you are going to reap what you sow. In everything, whether it is good or bad. You are going to reap what you sow. So I pray that this makes sense. And we need to change this about ourselves. Well, I have. And some people may have to change this. God bless.